Hi there, it's Street Fever. It's good to be back here again. And so, the 334 day journey ends tonight. It's the occasion of the UEFA Champions League for 2018 in Kiev. And it's going to be Real Madrid again in the Champions League final, but this time facing an English opponent, Liverpool. And I find myself a perfect place to enjoy this great clash. Four points for charity, adrenaline sports bar. I'm going to be here, catching the thrills and all the excitement dished up by the fans. Many headlines have popped up. Real Madrid and Liverpool going for the break. While they're doing that, I will be dishing out the stroke. All right, remember on Street Fever, it's about the fans and about sampling of opinions. And when you have a big clash, you expect the big expectations. Now I'm here already with one fan. We need to find out which corner is going to belong. You have the white corner, what about Real Madrid, and the red corner for the red, Liverpool. All right, hi, I'm Titus. Manuel. Manuel, nice to meet you, Manuel. Same here, thank It's you. a big night for everybody following European football. I'm quite sure you're ready for tonight's final. Yeah! So come which, on, which come side? On, uh, come on, I can see you're roaring already. Of course. <laughs> but you have to be very careful because you can see I'm wearing a referee's jersey, meaning I'm on referee's what, duty tonight. So after a couple of questions, let's see if you're going to be getting a yellow card or a red card. Huh? Okay, okay, first question, which side are you supporting tonight? Liverpool. Oh, oh you're red. Oh, red. 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 You've got Mo Salah. Oh, Mo Salah. <laughs> Never walk alone. All right, now, it's amazing that Liverpool, they have a very good, you know, um, attacking lineup against Real Madrid. So how do you think they're going to fare tonight? Mo Salah, Sane and Firmino. I see Salah getting a hat-trick. I go 3-1 Liverpool. Right. So, I'm here to support Adidas. Yeah. It's going to be some warm in favor. Real Madrid. La Liga. La Liga. I see 3 2. 3 2? Yes. Um, Real Madrid or Liverpool? Real Madrid. Real Madrid. Madrid. Yeah. Goal scorers? Goal scorer. Ronaldo 2. Mm. Garantel 1. 1. My prediction is. Um, Real Madrid 3, Liverpool 1. <laughs> yeah. This guy, he's not a Liverpool I'm fan. Being sincere. <laughs> I'm not so good at predicting much. Okay. I've been a very high scoring game that we look out for. Okay. It should be 3 1 for Madrid. 3 1 for Real Madrid. Yeah. Okay. If you get that prediction wrong, I'll be coming with my cards. So. <laughs> it's not like you've seen a red. <laughs> so just get yourself ready. <laughs> We hope that right. you get extra time. <laughs> You're too serious. So regulation In regulation days. time, I'll be here and you have to see <laughs> here the yellow. Real Madrid has got no one, no single person against the goal for them. And then Liverpool had the most unprecedented situation with a Mo Salah off. So is this the end of the dream for Liverpool? Um, it looks like it's the end, but I believe that's going to be... Uh, you know what I noticed? <laughs> Now you're turning and I, I, I believe that the, 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 the best for the team is to win it for Salah. I'm not worried at, at the moment because uh, <laughs> we want to. I'm not worried. I'm not worried. In honesty, I'm not. I believe the uh, second half still holds and uh, winner things for Real Madrid. Yeah, yeah. 
I, I, I believe that considering the way that Matt started off, like in the first half, there hasn't been more, any action, much action from sure. both sides. He can't really single out the player and say he has played so, so well. Okay. So I, I think the second half will be much more better. All right. Maybe 3-2? Three, 3-2, three, two. Three, two. Real Madrid or Liverpool? Uh, Liverpool. Liverpool to win. It's full time in Kiev, Adam Tani. Another record achievement for Zidane, record achievement for Real Madrid is just massive. Unfortunately, Liverpool will not be chasing the dream again. Um, I'm shut up. <laughs> My heart is crushed. <laughs> well, that's something I can do about it. I know. Here is one man who got the exact score correct, and his name is Bethel. Bethel, how on earth did, could you have imagined this sort of scoreline? Yeah, I felt, I felt, I felt with the with the type of armory that uh, Liverpool, I mean, um, the Roma they had, they had everything, they have everything to win the game, and I always knew that Liverpool would score at least one one goal. One goal, and I, I was waiting for that man, uh, Bill. Even in as much as I knew he wasn't going to come in from the start, I knew he was going to make an impact at some game. Yeah, that's what you get when you play with a La Liga team, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so indeed, they are the La Liga is not here to joke. La Liga, okay. Like like I said earlier, I'm a Barcelona fan, and I said to support Real Madrid because you know, they're in the La Liga. So spectacular performance. They use their experience, they use their skills, they use everything they had to win this game. I feel they should have just, um, if it's possible, just give you know? But it doesn't work that way, right? It doesn't work that way, unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> So after 334 days of Champions League football, Real Madrid are champions again for the third time in a row. Record win, record achievement for Zinedine Zidane and his voice. Do you want to say Champions League is boring? No, I think Real Madrid are just spectacular. Until next time, catch me on Street Fever. Have a great night. Ciao.